Hello, this is Murtech Viper, and I'm going to explain phase two of the spaceship simulation where we are actually on the bridge. Now, on the bridge, Rex Mundy has been doing a lot of work to give you a full feel of what it's like to be on the bridge. Some of the aspects to look at are first you're presented with this bridge question. As you answer this bridge question, it will tell the database and also update your status where you are and what you're doing. It will let you know that you're on phase two, the bridge. You're also going to be greeted by uh, a little robot. He'll help you out. He'll follow you around and give you information as you move around on the bridge. So just to start off with a few different aspects that are set up on this bridge. First, on the sidewall here, you have an image of the Starship Enterprise. On there, you'll notice that there are several key points. The bridge sim, the cockpit, and the captain's quarters. As you click on these different areas, it will either take you to an example of living quarters or a YouTube video or it will give you a URL to follow. So some nice information here on the layout of what a ship really looks like. What the interior is made of if you're traveling in space. Now again a lot of people will say well this is science fiction. Well yes but at one time you know we had a lot of items that was fiction but it's now a fact it's reality science fiction sometimes forces us or drives us to invent or wonder how can we do that so a lot of people have said well this is science faction where at one time you know it wasn't possible but with new technology we're able to make it happen in the corner here you'll notice a little radar this is another way that we're tracking where different avatars are and as you can notice we have uh, one person who's also throughout the simulation now you'll notice that I'm here Murtek Viper I'm actually in the blue ball which tells me that you know I'm on the captain's quarter so you won't see my little red ball however Penny Galaxy is close by she's 75 meters away so again another way of tracking avatars to let us know who's in the simulation and how they're interacting with the different components of the simulation now Rex Mundy has also set up some great content here this content has different YouTube videos it has information from NASA it talks about space and the time warp field all, or time space continuum a lot of great information here that the avatar can hear and listen and learn about. Now I have my sound effects turned off so that you'll hear my microphone and listen to how I'm explaining the different simulations so you don't hear that right now but when you actually participate you'll actually hear the different sound effects you'll hear Captain Picard you'll hear different commands come across and you'll be able to try to go through a launch sequence um, but as you go through this launch sequence, you're traveling from side to side here. Um, Rex Mundy has also done a, a great job of making this room look larger than what it actually is by putting an image on this side where it looks like, oh, we have more room over here, a captain's seat. Uh, we have other stations to monitor different happenings throughout the ship. Um, but as you work through, you're going to notice, oh, no the the nuclear reactor is offline I've got to find the chief engineer but I can't contact the chief engineer we can't find out where he is so it's my responsibility to go down to the engine room so from phase two we then would teleport to phase three the nuclear reactor or the engine room so this completes phase two of the simulation where we're at the bridge thank you